Hi guys, it's George Place here, back with another video. I know I said daily content and I got the headphones in, but this isn't a gameplay video. This is a disgusting video. So look, got you. I'm kidding. Um, this is discuss something. I just watched on YouTube. I think it's been out for a couple of days, maybe a week. I didn't check the uh, date on it. <coughs> Excuse me. But we will do a gaming video tonight. But I just thought I could. I mean, I could did this video. Over like some gameplay and everything, but I thought it would be better to just do a, do a quick vlog about it, get this video uploaded, and then do a quick gaming video tonight over the nun. I think it's going to be the nun, either that or we're going to go to Granny or the Arrow Schools plays, whatever I prefer playing. But anyway, this, use both hands because, oops, sorry guys. Um, this video is to discuss the video I watch. I'm going to try to put that video in the description, of course, about the Xbox One S All Digital Edition. I know it's not fake, of course. I don't think it's fake. Um, it doesn't look like it's fake, and I think Microsoft pretty much confirmed it. And I, my opinion on that shit is... I know I'm going to trigger a lot of Xbox One fanboys here. Stupid as hell. And let me tell you why. Everything's the same. All they did was get rid of the disk drive. Hence the name, All Digital Edition. Now, I'm not mad that's All Digital. Because I'm shaking my camera too much. I'd rather it be All Digital. Just so you don't have to worry about breaking your game disk or misplacing your game disc and then you throw a fit like I do when my game discs either come up missing because somebody borrows one of my Xbox One games or if they come up like scratch because I'm not taking good care of them and I will if I know I'm not taking good care of them I'll, I'll admit that I'm not and I'll throw a fit to myself that sounds weird um but if I know somebody borrowed my game and it like comes up scratch, yeah, I'll throw an even bigger fit. But all they did was delete the just fucking disk drive. How stupid is that? <sighs> all right, it's all digital edition, so of course they're going to delete the disk slot. But you may be asking, there might be something more to it, something new. And I got to say, when I watch this video, this trailer, over this fucking all digital edition on the Xbox One S, I got to say, there is, my dog is digging, sorry. There's absolutely nothing brand fucking new about this console. Besides the disc tray not being there and it's an all digital edition. Now, I am kind of mad at Microsoft. Um, in the back of my head, I'm going to have a job by the new consoles coming out, right? So, right now in my head, I'm thinking, next generation, when the PS5 comes out and the new Xbox comes out, I'm just going to switch over to PlayStation and get the fucking PlayStation 5 because if Microsoft pulls this dumbass stunt, next generation... I feel like there nobody's gonna want to deal with them anymore. I feel like this is a stunt to get more money. Now, don't get me wrong. I read the comments in that fucking video. Somebody said it's gonna be cheaper than the actual Xbox One S. I pretty sure the Xbox One S still goes for two nine 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 nine, three hundred bucks. Maybe 301, 302. But, what's it going to be like? 200? It's going to be 100 less, probably. Which will leave us with. If it's 100 less, it'll be like 19999. That's still 200 bucks, right? 201, or whatever you prefer. I don't give a fuck. Um, I still wouldn't buy it. Because. I don't think this is the right time to go to an all digital age yet. We're at the end of the lifespan, as we know, of PS4 and Xbox One S. I mean, Xbox One. My bad. Um, I don't think it's a perfect time 
to go to a digital age with our fucking games until the new consoles come out, the next generation. Then I won't be complaining. I'll be like, oh, they got rid of the disk drive? It's an all digital age now, like it should be. And we just buy our games online. We don't have to go to a fucking store worrying about pre-ordering there. I like GameStop or Walmart or whatever. We can just do it in our living room or our room or whatever room you fucking play your games at. Friend's house, whatever. I play my games, of course, in my living room, but I also sleep in my living room. That's the way I prefer it, and that's the way I like it. But I am telling you, when I get a job and everything, I am not buying the all-digital version because I got an Xbox One S right there. I can easily either pop a disc in or something and play it. Plus... We can buy digital games anyway on Xbox One. So why would Microsoft just get rid of the disk drive and pull the fucking stunt for us to spend more money on a console? That's basically the same thing. Just getting one little, rid of one major thing and be like selling it and be like, oh, Xbox One S digital version. That's really cool. We should sell it. I think they're, and another point, I think they're too late on the console anyway. I wouldn't be as mad at Microsoft right now if they release this console back when that Xbox One S first came out, like back in 2016. I'm pretty sure that's when they released the Xbox One S's. Like, or even, even like at the beginning of 2017, or hell, even, let's just put it, to, let's just, Say in the in the summer of 2017, if they released it like let's say along with the Xbox One S, I mean X, I'll be like, oh, um, they they did this. That's cool. I'll probably will buy it as a second console. In case if I want to buy games digitally, but I probably wouldn't because I can just buy them digitally anyway. I'm getting fed up with Microsoft as it is. I mean, they ain't doing nothing new. And Sony is doing everything. Like, I feel like Sony is doing everything in their power to make sure that they imply new stuff. Now, I know this thing seems biased. I'm leaning towards Sony more than Microsoft. And I fucking love Microsoft. I loved the 360 when it came out. I used to play on the original Xbox, if you guys remember that. Um, and now I'm playing on Xbox One S. And hell, even next generation, I might even be stupid. But first, buy the PlayStation 5 so I can play those games. And then I might just go ahead and buy an Xbox One. Um, not an Xbox One. The new Xbox anyway to play it on there. And by then I should have a PC so I can do gaming videos like that instead of mobile. And I'll buy games like that. But, pointing across, this new console is nothing new. Only disk drive is gone, buy games digitally only. That's it. All the technology inside of it, still the same. Except for, there's no disk drive in it. But there's still like a fan, a motherboard, everything else. Verdict, I will not spit, um, can't talk that. I will not waste your fucking money on this console. If you are, I'm sorry, you're stupid ass fuck. If you want to buy an Xbox One, go spend, if you have a 4K TV, you know what, if you have a 4K TV, and if you have enough money, go buy an Xbox One X. They're way much better. Or, hell, go buy an Xbox One S if you don't have 4K, and you can play games either and still play games even if you like them discs or whatever but that's it uh that's all i have this was just like a quick vlog um talking about the xbox one s sorry if i sounded heated but the new console it looks shit as hell so verdict don't not buy it
and save your fucking money. Gaming video tonight, either the Evil Nun, uh, Granny, or um, what was the other game I said? Uh, it was um, Air Scrolls Blades. I'll probably end up if I do two gaming videos tonight, like I want to do. One I'll probably make like at nine thirty. The other will probably make like at ten thirty, and the other will probably make at eleven thirty. The Air Scrolls Blades probably nine thirty. Granny ten thirty. The one on eleven thirty. Then upload three of those. Anyway, I love you guys. See you on the next video. And peace.